Welcome back to Northwestern Outdoors Radio. I'm John Cruz. We're taking you to Southwest Idaho. That's where we're talking to Mond Warren. He's the Senior Regional Director for Ducks Unlimited in Idaho. He is helping putting together a sportsman show. It's called the Great Northwest Outdoor Expo, taking place Friday, June 29th through Sunday, July 1st in Nampa. Mond, welcome to the show. Thank you, John. Glad to be here. So, Mond, why don't you tell me a little bit about this show and and why you're putting it on in June? This is not exactly a sportsman show season, if you know what I mean. Yeah, John, you know, this isn't a typical trade show, typical trade show season. This is a, an indoor-outdoor show that has a lot of activities, a lot of things going on. The weather's going to be nice. We're trying to stay out of the July-August time frame. Big game hunters are out uh, scouting their spot and looking for animals. And so it's a good time for us to do this at the end of June. Well, I'll tell you what, Mon, I'm really impressed that for a first-time show, you've got well over 100 exhibitors participating. Again, especially given the fact you're doing this in the summer when a lot of folks are busy out in the field in terms of guides and outfitters. So... Let's run through some of the exhibitors that you're really excited about having here this year. You know, John, we've we've got some, not just exhibitors, but activities. I mean, we've got activities and and businesses from all over. Uh, We've got Honda coming in, Suzuki coming in. We're building ATV tracks. You can actually get on a track, test drive a a machine, talk to them about the machines, and and buy it right there if you want to. you know, we've got uh, RVs. We're going to have a big section of just RVs. Uh, we're doing a rock crawling show itself, where spectators can sit down and watch the big machines go over the rocks and navigate the course. You know, exhibitors, we've got everybody from Buck Knives to Cryptek. Camouflage is coming, Cryptek Outdoor Group. Ram Truck is our title sponsor for the show. There's going to be Ram Trucks and Jeeps there. Um, Tangle Free Waterfowl. Elk 101 is going to be there with some elk calling seminars, and, and we're doing an elk calling competition there. So if you guys think you're good at bugling, come bring it on, and we got some prizes, cash and merchandise prizes. A lot of different outdoor-related uh, gear, services, Eberly stock backpacks, uh, retriever clubs, got game technologies, and even you know firearms such as Nemo Arms is coming to join us. Well, Mond, truly, if you're a hunter, this sounds like an event you don't want to miss. Let's talk a little bit more about that elk calling contest. You've got the world championship elk caller, Corey Jacobson, that's going to be one of the judges, don't you? We do. There's nobody better than Corey, and uh, he's proven that many times. He's going to be here helping us judge. He's also doing some seminars to give some input on on how to improve your elk hunting and elk calling uh, out in the field. We've also got some other celebrity judges coming in. It's co-hosted with Got Game Technologies, and uh, Ju- Julie McQueen's coming in to help judge that as well. She's a local TV celebrity. Sounds fantastic. And, you know, you've got the ATV track, you've got the elk calling contest, but you've got some some other attractions, too, we should talk about at the Great Northwest Outdoor Expo. Again, taking place Friday, June 29th through Sunday, July 1st at the Ford Center at Nampa. And that includes Doc Dogs. That's always a lot of fun to watch. It is. That's going to be right center stage in the amphitheater at the Idaho Center. You can sit on the grass and and have a beverage and watch the dogs jump. It's going to be a warm day, so the water's going to look inviting, and, and we've got a, they've got a good lineup of contestants coming in. It'll be a good show with the Doc Dogs. Something else you've got is an outdoor film festival. Tell me about that. Yeah, the, the outdoor film festival, they're coming in. They're, these guys are not only going to show us outdoor films submitted by local hunters, they're also going to be talking to us and doing some seminars on how to film your hunt. So it'll be two hours of of just discussion about filming your hunts and what to capture, how to capture it, and also showing uh, films on what people have have submitted in in their outdoor film competition. Well, I'll tell you what, Mond, uh, just that latter part alone makes me want to attend that film festival right there because I certainly need a lot of help when it comes to filming my activities outdoors. And we touched on this a little bit already. You've got some great seminars for some great pros going on. Uh, in addition to what Corey Jacobson's going to offer, I understand C.J. Buck, uh, the president of Buck Knives, is going to be giving a seminar. Who else is going to be giving seminars? 
We've got Andy Allen. Andy, if, if you ever watch uh, barbecuing on TV, he's with Rooftop Barbecue. He's, uh, he's coming in with Green Mountain Grills and doing an actual private pitmaster techniques class. It's going to be limited to 25 people. And then they're also going to be doing some open uh, seminars on backyard barbecue and, and how to do it right. Julie McQueen is coming in. She's an outdoor personality TV host. Uh, she's going to be talking about, uh, you know, women in hunting and, and conservation and hunting. You know, one that I'm really excited about, Justin Webb. He's with the Foundation for Wildlife Management. These guys are wolf experts, and they're, they're coming in and talking about, how to, about wolf hunting, how to trap wolves, just doing some seminars to educate folks on, on how to get out there and, and chase wolves. We've, we've all thought about doing it out in the field, and he's here to give us some tips on how to be successful. So that's, that's a really exciting one that I'm, I'm looking forward to hearing. Uh, I would, too, because anyone who's hunted wolves, folks, they'll tell you that's one of the hardest animals to hunt. They are extremely wary, and if they've been hunted before, uh, good luck trying to get them in range uh, if you're hunting them again. So let's talk about where the proceeds are going. You're with Ducks Unlimited. Ducks Unlimited is putting this on. You know, what is this money going to be used for? Is it going to stay in the state of Idaho? Yeah, this money, all proceeds from this event are going to conservation. And you know, John, hunters and outdoorsmen are the biggest conservationists there are and this this event's right around there we're we're trying to get people outdoors and and so all the event proceeds will go to ducks unlimited will go toward conservation what are some of the big projects ducks unlimited has undertaken in idaho over the last few years we've had a couple of big ones in idaho and it's all across the northwest it's not just idaho it's washington oregon you know it's everywhere one of the bigger ones that's noteworthy is the clark fork delta project up on Lake Ponderé. We've gone in and done one of the biggest inland delta projects in the, in the nation, conserving and restoring that where the Clark Fork comes into the Ponderé Lake. And it's, it's a great project. It's open for public hunting, and it's, it's really coming around. It's been on for a couple of years now, and I understand the vegetation's growing in nicely and, and will really make some good habitat for waterfowl. We're starting a lot of work up in the Silver Valley area, a lot of the cleanup from the mines. And we're excited about some of that work. It's going to create some great habitat up there in the Silver Valley. Oh, I think it's fantastic. And you're absolutely right. It's needed in that region. Uh, Mining is a big deal with the economy, but it's caused a lot of damage over the years. So if DU can restore it through providing healthy wetlands, that's going to be helpful for everybody that lives up there. Last but not least, what are the hours? How much does it cost to get in to the Great Northwest Outdoors Expo? Show hours. We're opening the show Friday from noon to 8, Saturday from 9 to 8 o'clock, and Sunday from 9 to 5. Tickets are on sale at the IC Tickets at the Idaho Center in Nampa. And uh, the single ticket's $8. Uh, children 12 and under are free. But you come to this, we anticipate you're going to want to come more than one day with all the things we have going on. So we've got actually some weekend packages and some family packages available to, to get you in the door all weekend and, and save you some money. So, you know, a single weekend package is $16 for all three days. And we've got some family packages to really discount if you've got some people you want to bring. It's the Great Northwest Outdoors Expo. It's taking place again Friday the 29th through Sunday, July 1st at the Ford Center in Nampa. You can find out more at NorthwestOutdoorExpo.com. Make plans to attend. Sounds like this is going to be a great time for a great cause. That cause being Ducks Unlimited doing great work here in the Northwest. Mon, thanks for sharing this with us today on Northwestern Outdoors Radio. Thank you, John. See you there. Many people think that Ducks Unlimited is a hunting club or clothing manufacturer. It's not. Ducks Unlimited is the leading waterfowl and wetlands conservation organization in the world. Here in Idaho, we've lost nearly 76% of our wetlands. Ducks Unlimited is working to stop that loss. In Idaho alone, DU has restored and conserved over 27,000 acres of wetlands. Learn more about the benefits of wetlands and what Ducks Unlimited is doing for Idaho's future. Visit ducks.org Idaho.